Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you how to make patch backups in the Roland TV3. First thing, you need to understand that the TV3 is a very powerful synthesizer with many parameters that you're only able to access through system exclusive. This uh, tool can be found on the internet um, and it gives you access to all of the different parameters. Okay. Um, in this case, I'm just going to do a demonstration. So this is preset C14. You push receive, everything in the display updates and that's C14. You can pull it up on your own TV3 to see that this is the one I'm talking about. Okay, as you noticed, it updated this. Now, when you push this receive button, what it does is it sends out some request strings in system exclusive. And then it populates the, um, the display, the uh, software based on that. So what you can do is you can do the same thing in SysX Library. So what you do is you download this system exclusive file. Um, I'll put a link for it in the description. Um, and then basically all you do is send this file to the TV3 and then record what the TV3 sends back. It's a patch request. There is one issue though. You can't send system exclusive from SysX Librarian at the same time that you're receiving it. So you have to run two instances of the software. So it's actually easily done. You go to command line, you find where your application is stored, and then you open up a, another instance of that application using open minus n. So open minus n, SysX Librarian. There's a second copy. Okay, get this out of here. Now we have two instances of SysX library. Okay, easy enough, right? So what you do is on the one you want to record on, you push record minute, and it's waiting. Then when you're ready, hit play on the one you're sending on. You'll see that the receiving one received 11 messages with 422 bytes. If you received that message, that means you've gotten the patch, okay? So there you go. We'll call this one... TB3C14, since that's the preset number that you exist on. Now, here it is, we're still in C14. Now, let's put this on a different patch number. I've moved this to B37. This sounds like this. Totally different, right? But now, just hit play in System uh, Success Librarian, Sysx Librarian, and you've got the patch, and you can put it anywhere you want. So B37. Okay. Another one, B6, just send the patch. There it is. What I like to do is just use it on the user patch. This is nothing right now. But if I send the patch, there it is, on you one. So, I've saved now the copy of this patch and can use it whenever I want. Now, calling it from SysX Librarian is a cinch. You just send the file to the okay, I'll put a link to the uh, the system exclusive file you have to send. And uh, if you have any questions, just hit me up in the comments. Thanks.